are you? Good, thank you. Awesome. Can you talk a little bit about joining Black Lightning about the show? What are really excited to do? Um, well, obviously I'm really excited to be part of something so historical, you know, the first black comic book superhero on network television, I think, so that's exciting. I think it's sort of the perfect time for it. And um, I'm excited to work with Mara and Celine because I think they've got such an incredible vision for the show and I think what makes it special is that, you know, you've got to see the fun superhero elements, but what makes it special is this family and this family dynamic that's really real and actually, you know, they're not perfect. They've made mistakes, their marriage is over, they're trying to figure it out, they've got teenage girls who want to do things they shouldn't be doing. So in that way it feels really real and sort of grounded in reality. And I think that's quite a unique and I think that's something that the audience are going to really kind of be drawn into, hopefully. I know. How does she Nightmare. Help? No, I really don't know. That's a good question. Um, I think, you know, Lynn is kind of the, the glue of the family, and I think she's the heartbeat of the family, and I think she sort of grounds them. And I think she's the nurturer, and I think she's just got to, you know, be there for them as they navigate this crazy world of having, you know, being young women, which is, you know, hard enough as it is, and then having superpowers. So, you know, I imagine that sort of, she's really her superpower is just is being the nurturer, you know? Does the show, um, do you find that it sidesteps some of the... Uh the cliches that can pop up when you have like a non-superhero power surrounded, a non-superhero power character surrounded by superheroes, you know what I mean? Because sometimes in these stories that character can, you know, they, they can, you, I mean, I'm sure you've seen some of these shows, that they, they can like, you know, sort of like, when there's, you know, everything, ugh, I'm trying to verbalize, forgive me, but you know, they're not as showy. Yeah. And, no, I and mean, so, I like, do you have to find it, do you find that as an actor, you have to kind of go farther to make her... No, I don't think so. I think, you know, it's all about balance, yeah. you know, and I think when an audience watches something, they want to see all parts of that world. And and also, like, in, in real life, you know, that's, that's the thing. Like, you're going to watch three superheroes in one show. Mm. That's incredibly powerful, visually dynamic. You're going to need an emotional uh, weight. You just, you need that. That's just balance, you know. So I think, actually... That's a, my character's a good counter to all of that. Obviously, I don't know for sure how Lynn's going to unfold in the story, but I think that's a really important element in 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 the family, you know. So hopefully, you know, it might not be as showy, but I think there'll hopefully be like an emotional depth that people can connect to, yeah. and I think that's important. Oh yeah, yeah. Will you get a little jealous that, that you're going to miss on some of the action, or you want to? You know what? I mean, I've played, I've, 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 I've been, I've, you know, done some actiony things, so I know what it's like, and I know that it's fun. I'm actually just looking forward to seeing how sh my character navigates their world and how she fits into that, and, and what she can kind of give to them. So I'm not, no, I'm not, I'm not worried about missing out. Not, not jealous yet. <laughs> not, not yet, exactly. Ask me next year. Oh yeah. And I'll be like, oh god, I wish I was doing what they were doing. I will. <laughs> I will. <laughs> So Jeff was originally hung up the hood mm -hmm. and he was How was like going to react to the person Well, it's strange, you know, we, we, the irony is he sort of gives up the crime fighting because of his children and because of his wife, but it's actually his children that kind of draw him back into it. You know, whether at the start of the story, and the girls have gotten into trouble with this, you know, gang, and that's, he feels like he has no choice but to put the costume on. So I think that's going to be an, an ongoing struggle for his character is like how do you use your powers for good and how do you manage that you know and I and that's also then going to be the struggle of, of the daughters as well but you know um, I think there's still a lot of feeling between Lynn and Jeff and I wouldn't be surprised if there was some kind of reconciliation eventually thank you so much, thank you so much. Best nice of to luck. meet you thank you